This is the installation of 65 ton swage press fittings using a 65 ton press. What we want to do first is hook the hose up. The tool is completely assembled. Now we assemble the lower die block, which has a quick release push button, spring loaded on the bottom side. You press the quick release, you assemble the lower die block onto the press. We're gonna take a two inch piece of bus, it's extruded aluminum pipe, and we're going to measure it with our swage gauge. The small side will not fit two inch bus. If it fit the bus pipe, then you would have something smaller than two inch and it would not work in our system because our system works in outside diameters. We're going to clean, this is a simulated bus run, we're gonna clean our bus with a stainless steel aluminum brush. Now we'll clean the piece of bus with scotch Brite to remove any grease, fingerprints, or any foreign material on the bus run. Again, we're simulating a 20, 40 foot stick of bus with a six inch piece. My bus is clean. Take our quality gauge, which is a multifunction gauge, with the window and the pin protruding from the back side. Place the pin on the back of the bus. Take a magic marker and mark a window, which is a minimum and maximum insertion point for the bus fitting. You can see the window. Our bus fitting from any bus fitting from one inch to four inch only has one compression required per side. In between the two lines, the fitting says swage here. It also has the part number. It has the recommended bus for use with this fitting as well as the dies to be used with this fitting for proper installation. Okay. Remove the plug. Inside the fitting you see contact surface paste which ensures the sealing as a moisture barrier as also a contact paste to ensure contact resistance. For demonstration purposes I'm going to use the table as part of my format. Slide the fitting into the bus. Make sure my window is at proper insertion point. Now we're going to check the compression with the large side of the gauge. The gauge will not fit anywhere on the bus except where you compressed. There you have your 65 ton 2 inch swage compression on seamless bus.